Well, jails in Kentucky are feeling less of a burden getting some inmates mental health evaluations. WDRB's Travis Ragsdale explains the fix that has eased a massive backlog. There are at least some inmates here at Metro Corrections and really all across Kentucky that can't have a trial until they've done a mental health evaluation. And no one will argue that having a speedy trial is a bad thing. Helps reduce the jail population, uh, helps bring closure to families, and, and quite frankly, for individuals who are accused, gives them the opportunity to have their cases heard much more quickly. That's why a problem with getting some inmates mental health evaluations before trial was creating such a headache. If there is ever a question about whether somebody is competent to stand trial in Kentucky, this is where they have to go to be evaluated. KCPC in LaGrange. WDRB first reported on the issue last March when some patients were waiting up to a year and a half to get an evaluation. You know, if we're waiting sometimes 18 months to get evaluations done and now they're going much more quickly, it gives us an opportunity to move those cases forward and it's about half the time of what we were doing. So how did the fix happen? Now, KCPC is sending psychologists to jails when they can and doing evaluations on site and using telehealth as well. Still, there are some inmates required to go to KCPC for their test, but even that number is down as well. We're currently up to date with any evaluations that can be done at the jail, and I think our folks waiting to go to KCPC for inpatient um, is down to 35, so that's really, really good for us, really low for us. And that means faster trials and fewer people in jail. KCPC is still doing with some in-person evaluation delays, but that is simply because of a lack of staff. Outside of Metro Corrections, Travis Ragsdale, WDRB News.